hello and welcome back to Shumi Village. This is not actually our final destination, but I wanted to pay a brief visit here. I think I've come to the wrong house, though. Uh... Wait, wait, wait... Oh, that's... Okay, that's what that is. Yeah, I don't need Fiaga. Um... What about... <laughs> right. Anyway, no. I went to the wrong house. Um, I believe the one I actually want to talk to is uh, this guy. So they're working on the statue again. Artson hopes they don't ask me to help. Oh. Ha. Okay, I thought there would be a little bit more to say there. Oh well! <laughs> Maybe if I talk to you? The look in your face. They must be not be working seriously. The Moomba can help us. Please go ask the Moomba outside for help. It will become an order if I ask, so please. Interesting. Ah, uh, the move is back there now. Hopefully helping. Oh, it's you. What do you want? Attendant isn't go gonna do that. Attendant doesn't feel like it. The elder said that? That's not fair. The elder's not giving me any choice. Okay, fine. Attendant will work. Okay. <laughs> well, well, I'm happy I did that so that we could see this, even if that's all it came down to. My attendant is finally working. Great! The statue should be completed soon. Maybe it's none of my business, but what's the point of forcing him to do something against his will? You don't understand. There's nobody in this village who admires Master Laguna more than my attendant. There is a reason why my attendant refuses to work on the statue. My attendant strongly wishes to leave here and fight alongside Master Laguna, not to spend time building a statue. Therefore, my attendant does not want to become an elder. One cannot fight or leave the village once one becomes an elder. A Shumi becomes an elder, or something else. I think one must have wits to become an elder. I was very fortunate. I believe my attendant will become an elder someday as well. That would be... Pretty ironic. Is there any way to prevent the evolution? It is not the Shumi way to abuse our knowledge and pursue personal ambitions. All of us have accepted our destinies. Well, it sounds like they may need one more person to help. I would love to see my, my attendant go and pursue personal dreams. I once had dreams too, but as an elder, my responsibilities must always come first. Hmm.
So yeah, we got a little bit more story. I'm glad we did. And I hope I haven't missed anything. Well, I don't think so. Should I rest up? What's Skull's HP look like? Uh, actually, I'm gonna do a thing here. Damn it! Yes. So, I have a very important reason for doing this. <laughs> Which you'll... Oh, I'm silence as well. Silence is actually probably more important. Um, You're good. You, I would rather have... Well, actually, I'm fine with this. I'm not going to need that right away. You, though, I... Well, again, I'm not going to need card right away. Uh, okay, we'll keep it like this. Hmm... I'm tempted to leave for Noah's HP this low, but, well, then again, I don't know. We'll play it by ear, is what we'll do. Oh, actually, though, I thought about some more, and she should really have an item command. Okay, one last thing, actually. Since I'm doing this anyway, we'll just do all of it. For the part I'm doing next, I am going to really want Water Junction to my elemental attack. For, well, pretty much every one. That, I don't know if Quake will come into play or not. But I know Water will. Hmm... <laughs> You probably won't be regular attacking much, but we'll throw that on there as well. Okay, now that that's taken care of, uh, I'll see you in a minute at our actual destination. This was sort of just like a detour, I suppose you could say. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you in a minute. Okay, I believe the item... Item, no. The area, the island we want, is, uh, right here. Welcome to Caxbar Island. Uh, I'm gonna save, because, uh, this is a little bit dangerous. Arguably, I should have someone who's not Irvine in my party, but, uh, we'll play it by ear. I think. Wait, let me double check something really quickly here. What magic does this? What sort of magic do I want? What sort of magic does it have, rather? Uh, because I might actually want to wait a little bit to do this. Let's see... that is... nope, doesn't matter. Okay, yeah. We good. I still might want someone who's not Airbind, just so that my average level is lower, but, uh... You see that green thing? Oh, no, we missed. There it is! Behold! Jumbo Cactuar! Ah, uh, let's try to steal first. And, uh... Oh, okay. That looked like an Earth-based attack to me. Uh, okay, wow. Squall is really hurting. I actually missed something there. But, yeah. Hmm. So I have Angel Wing now. That's a new limb break for Renoa. We're not going to use it because I'm not set up to use it. But basically, it's like a Berserk state but for magic instead of attack. You don't use any spells when you use it, and it can destroy enemies with the proper setup. But I do not have the proper setup. Uh, that is exactly the one I wanted. I don't care about that. Uh, I don't really care about those either. No, we are just straight up going to spam one breaks. I guess you can mud, Irvine, since you're not getting a limit break, I guess. 
And uh, in case it wasn't obvious from my setup, Jumbo Quackdar here is weak against water. But also, it has 10,000 needles, which is an attack that is guaranteed to kill me. Let's see... Yeah, that one, right there. Good thing I'm immune. I'm just going full cheese mode on this. <laughs> Maybe I'll summon Leviathan, actually. Maybe. Maybe. It's tempting. I, I kind of feel like I want to lay off on the limit breaks, though, until I have success to steal. Stolen, I guess. I love that animation. Well, I mean, Rough Divide is something. You can do something cooler than that, Squall. So, incidentally, the reason I wanted the item command is also because he can just one-shot me. I'm... Well, I'm being... I'm, I'm lucky with Renault's Limit Breaks, frankly. It's just letting me get away with Invincible Moon. <laughs> but, uh... I would potentially be using a lot of Phoenix Dance on this fight, is the thing. It's just sort of... Okay, I got it. Great. Who has Leviathan, actually? If it's Irvine, I think I will use it. Just, just because. Oh, there's 10,000 needles. Ah, uh, it's not Irvine. That's disappointing. Oh well. That's not actually doing much damage to it. Well, Squirrel's Limit Break is really the way to fight Jumbo Quackstar here. Um... Anyway, since it has a custom Limit Break for Squall, which has a ton of hits in it... Uh, but yeah, the, the, the big cactus here has a lot of HP. So, uh, this is just gonna be sort of like. Just, you know, dealing massive damage until we've, we're, we've won, hopefully. Oh, okay, yeah, there we are. Let's use AP ammo. More invincibility! Oh, yes! And that is how Squall murders everything. But, uh, we have- okay, you see how it just moved there? Oh, okay, actually we just killed it. But uh, the thing with Jumbo Quactar there is it runs away if you've almost killed it, so you need to be careful about that. Uh, of course, I got Lionheart at a really opportune moment to just murder it. But, you didn't see it, but I got an achievement because... Oh yes. We just got a new GF. We just got a new GF. It is terrific. Um, so, let me think here really quickly. I know 
the next GF I get, I'm going to want to give to Irvine here. Probably. And he has Pandemona as well. Then the one after that is going to be Squall. But, you know, let's double check. So, first of all, Jumbo Quactar here. Cactuar, whatever. Quactar. Um, it deals damage equal to 100 times its level. So, right now it'll deal exactly 2,000 damage every time I use it. Just something to keep in mind. Oh, it has all the bonuses. I forgot about that. Yeah, I think Evasion Up is the right call here. There's gonna be three of these. That's two, one, two, three. Uh, what's, what does it learn? What is the... Is there any, like, important abilities that I want? <laughs> Not really. I mean, there's definitely some really important abilities, like Evasion Boost! And Luck Boost! But in terms of... Like, there's nothing... In, there are useful abilities, but nothing really important, like... Med Level Up. It's what I mean. And, uh, I guess this level is really low as well. You- none of you have evasion. You have luck, though. So... The speed doesn't actually matter. Uh, you don't have vitality, though? Man... But I'm gonna give that one to you- okay, no. We're gonna give you to Renoa. Oh, yes. You have enough HP. Let's get some of that strength and magic in there. I think. Actually, Squall would benefit from me. Well, you have magic boost, but not strength boost. Mm. Whatever. This should be good. And uh, one of you guys mastered something, didn't you? Maybe it was Summit Magic times 20 on Shiva. Yeah, that's probably it. Uh, oh no, Siren's just done. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, I don't really care about the HP, so why not? Actually, I should probably be using the same logic here. <laughs> Auto Reflect is really good. I should also probably actually get. Well, this doesn't squall, so that doesn't matter, though. Man, I really screwed up with the status effects. Uh, with the status effect GF distribution in this playthrough. Oh well! It doesn't, fortunately, it doesn't matter too much. I haven't really been punished for it. Especially not with the Chocobo world where I can just get a freaking ribbon. That, that, that definitely makes things easier. Uh, okay. So. I think I am just about done for the day, but there is one more thing I want to do before I just call it. I want to take off this completely. I guess we'll throw on, like, strength boost or something. No, throw on speed boost. That, that's actually more relevant. We're going to save our game. Because this is Cac Cactuar Island. We got Jumbo Cactuar. But there's still plenty of regular cactuars. Which Squall's really good at murdering, but the other guys, uh, yeah, they they run away really quickly. Uh, can you, like, limit break your Squall? No? Whatever. Irvine's got a limit break. I don't know if I want the limit break. The pro- I didn't want an invisible moon either, though. I actually wanted to attack Renoa. Like, the problem is, cactuars have insanely high evasion. And also, they run away really fast. Which is not a problem for Squall, because he can just do that. But it can be a problem for other characters. And the reason this is important is because... Tax Wars give very little experience. Almost none. But! They give a ton of AP! Let 
Like, seriously, a shit ton of it. Uh, let's throw on card now. Uh, you still need to bubble up yet. So, uh, I'm not even going to do this a lot now. I... Uh, who the heck just leveled up? You did. Give me... HP is more useful. I guess that's the only thing you have left. Yeah, okay. But yeah, one more of those, two more Cactor deaths, and I will have med level up with Alexander. And then I can say that I'm done. So actually, I'm going to just do that right now, because I want you to see what I'm going to do with that. And then I'll probably come back here, like, after I have all of the GS, just to, like, fill them out. Fill out whatever I'm missing, you know? It won't even take very long. Of course, also, I should probably... I probably should actually heal, because right now I could get one shot by a Cactuar. That wouldn't be the best. They do have a uh, thousand needles, after all. But uh, the reason I didn't is because I wanted to just use a limit break that could kill all of them. Which I did not get. I mean, I got Lionheart, which is really cool. But uh, that only hits one Cactuar. Yep, you sure killed that Cactuar Squall. Oh, it ran away. Well, we got two of them. That's all we needed. Oh, we got Call Shop 2. That's really great. Okay, so. First of all, let's go back in here. Uh... You definitely have better things to learn. At least marginally. Uh, you definitely, super definitely have better things to learn. Although this may not actually be better, but whatever. Um, you have better things to learn for sure. Like, Auto Potion. That's pretty good. Yeah. But I finally have Med Level Up. Which is good, because I can make potion pluses, and high potion pluses, and mega potions. Let's actually, let's actually do this. Uh, yeah, sure. But no, uh, oh, cool. Mm -hmm. But no, actually, we need... Remedy pluses. Six of them, specifically. Because now we can use... Uh, where is it? Solomon's Ring. You called upon me! I am... Doom Train! It is a... I shall become your ally! Uh, it's a... yeah. Yeah. So, we got Doom Train! We got another GF. It's awesome. Uh, we're gonna do that one right away, because it seems somewhat relevant. Or Forbidden Medicine. You know, we'll do that first. Then we'll do Times 4 Status. <laughs> kind of a shame to put Dark Side and Absorb on the person who already has both of them, but whatever. We're still giving it to Irvine. The reason being... The reason being, we're going to actually want to summon Doom Train. Uh, so Irvine is the natural choice. Yeah. Yeah, that, that, that's how that one works. Okay! So, now that uh, now that we've done that, only two GFs to go, uh, I think I'll call it here. Join me next time when... 
Actually, I genuinely don't know what I'm going to be doing next time, but I will be definitely be doing something. Oh yeah, something. All right. <laughs> Until then, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy Kiss Blue, and have a great day. Bye.